Hi everyone, it's Alicia with Doherty Dozen and today I'm taking you Easter shopping for my 10 kids. Easter is exactly one month from today, but I've learned the hard way. You gotta shop ahead of time when you're shopping for 10 kids because you need 10 of everything. And if you shop too close to the holiday, they're wiped out. You're not gonna find 10 pairs of swim goggles or 10 pairs of whatever you're buying. Harley is at home with Amelia and Aunt Kiki, and then the other nine kids are in school. So it's just me. Um, shopping is oddly my me time. I enjoy it. Uh, people always say, you know, what do you do for me time? I'm like, I shop and I cook. <laughs> like, doesn't that count? So to Walmart first. I'm going to hope I can get most everything at Walmart. I also have to look for Easter outfits and I love Walmart clothes because when you have 12 people in your family, we have all different sizes. We have toddler sizes, kids sizes, women's sizes, men's sizes, and Walmart, I have found I can find coordinating outfits. This is not a promo for Walmart, by the way. I'm just telling you because I appreciate Walmart for that large family hack. I love their little shirt suit outfits for boys. So I'm hoping they have those in stock. I was looking online and I didn't see them. So I don't know. Hopefully they're in store. Okay, so here's my OCD. Whenever I take my reusable bags after the last shopping trip, I fold them neatly and line them up nicely. And my husband did it this time and bless his heart. Like I'm walking in with this. What What is this? How do I, I... And let's go. First stop, Easter section. Dash loved this Peeps cereal last year. So I had to get a few boxes of those. PSA, don't buy the Easter grass. It will still be Easter without it and you'll have sanity. Every year I get the kids a bucket as their Easter basket. I chose My Little Pony for Harley, Trucks for Bodie, Spider-Man for Jason, Dinosaurs for Jordan, Paw Patrol for Dash, Butterflies for Zoe, Frozen for Bree, Minion for Patrick, and Alex and James don't really care what they get. These look awesome. It's a little Peeps stuffed animal with a Peeps blanket. And the Peeps have those beads in them. My sensory kids will love this thing. Let's keep going. These little fidget balls look cool and they definitely look durable and that's a good thing for my kids. My kids love bubble wands. I'm sure they'll dump them out immediately, but you gotta buy them anyways. Peeps! There are some new flavors this year. I don't know about this, but donut flavor? Definitely. Got some tablecloths. I love these activity ones. And some cute Easter baking supplies. Don't forget the Easter plates. I decided to get each of the kids their own fishing pole this year for Easter. I'm tired of them fighting over fishing poles every time we go. I got them all these quick release ones with the button. They're just so much easier for kids to use. Lucky for me, I found 10 different designs. So no fighting over fishing poles this year. Let's head over to the toy section and see what we can find. Ooh, sidewalk chalk. My kids go through so much sidewalk chalk, so I'm gonna go ahead and get 10 of those. I always get each of them a pinwheel every year and we put them in the front garden. It always looks so pretty. And then I got sad because they don't have the adorable Easter suits for the boys this year. But this shirt caught my eye and it looks super cute with some navy shorts. So I got those for the boys and headed over to the girls section and found this dress actually in the women's section that will match nearly perfectly. Got that for Zoe, Brie, and myself. I've somehow not found the Easter candy section yet. So let's check grocery. Yep, <laughs> there it is. Uh, so much. Easter candy, what? Why are there so many choices for an Easter bunny? I can't, it's too many, too many. 
I don't know. I, I just chose this random one. It was cheap, <laughs> looked cute. Got each of the kids a Jelly Belly package. Got an impulse buy these hot tamale peeps for Alex. He'll love them. This is cute, a candy necklace, bracelet, and Easter glasses for only $1.98. Definitely getting 10 of those. Found these Pringles. Kids will love these. Gotta get 10 of those. Sometimes it's just easier to take the whole box. That's about all I can find here. So we're gonna head to check out now. Okay, I did more damage there than I thought I was gonna do, so. I'm done for today. I'm gonna get the rest on Amazon. Uh, I just, I don't need too much more. I need shirts for the boys, the Alex and James and Josh. I don't know why I call them boys still. And I need a dress for Harley. And then I need Cadbury eggs because I feel like it's not Easter without Cadbury eggs. Is it just me? So here is my receipt. Uh, yeah, I'm always like the winner of the longest receipt ever. But I wanted to tell you about my cashier. Um, now I'm always a super large order and I get it. It's, it's overwhelming, trust me, I get it. I always feel bad for my cashier. I know it's overwhelming. So I'm checking out and my cashier was really flustered, um, just really overwhelmed and she, I was trying to help her as much as possible. And she's like, I'm sorry, I'm just really overwhelmed today. It's not you, I'm just having a day. I'm really tired, I'm really overwhelmed. And I was like, you're fine, I'm not in a rush. I'm not, you're fine, take your time. Let's count everything. She wanted to count, make sure we had 10 of everything. And you know, I helped her and then I said, she's like, I'm so bad, I, shouldn't, I should not have complained to you. I'm like, you are fine. I said, trust me. We all have these days. Trust me, I have them too. And I remind myself, I gotta take it one day at a time, one hour at a time, one minute at a time, or I get overwhelmed. And then I'm flustered and then I'm stressed out. And she's like, is that how you have so much energy? I'm like, yeah, just, I said, trust me. Once you leave here, you're gonna step outside. It's beautiful out. It's gonna brighten your whole mood. I said, take it one minute at a time. By the time I left, um, she was in a much better mood. So it's just kind of my reminder that we don't have to always be in a hurry. What are we in a hurry for? I'm not in a hurry to get home and wash dishes. So if we're not always in a hurry, we can take those moments to connect with other people and brighten their day. Okay. Thankfully, Harley is taking a nap today. So um, yeah, now I'm gonna sneak all this stuff up to my room. Okay, I brought everything up to my room past a napping Harley and I'm gonna sort it all out on my bed and just kind of then go from there and see what I still need to order. Ta-da! I don't know why this always makes me so happy. 10 donut peeps, 10 fidget balls, 10 bubble wands, 10 jelly bellies, 10 necklace glasses sets, 10, okay, no, I'm sorry. I actually bought 11 pinwheels. Um, I didn't know how to count in the store, I guess. 10 chocolate bunnies, 10 things of sidewalk chalk, 10 cute little peeps stuffed animals and blankets. 10, well, actually 20 lollipops. 10 things of bunny Pringles. 10 buckets. Um, mom hack, we take these buckets on our road trips as their puke buckets. <laughs> so every year their Easter basket is um, also their new puke bucket. 
I have almost all of their outfits. And then 10 fishing poles. And I did get, where did they go? Well, somewhere in here. Oh yeah, there they are. A uh, thing of hooks. We always use um, real worms. I also forgot I got new bathing suits for everyone from Albion in Houndstooth. I haven't even like opened them yet. Okay, these are the boys. Cute. And then they ha still have their black swim shirts from last year. So that will go with it good. Oh my gosh, I love this. Okay, this is Breeze. And if you have a girl like Bree that's like right in between kid clothes and women's clothes, it is so hard to find them a bathing suit that's appropriate because like, sorry, I know this is nothing about Easter, but please tell me why, like why it's either frilly little, little tutu unicorn bathing suits, little girls, or like these low cut women's bathing suits. I'm not putting that on my 11 year old child. No, but I'm this, uh, oh my gosh. I've never bought Albion bathing suits before. I'm so excited. This is modest, but it's still cute. She's going to love it. So I'm gonna put their bathing suits in. We open the pool right around Easter time. So I'm also gonna get each of them a pair of goggles and probably like, a pool toy or something. I'm gonna order the rest. Um, Amazon, Oriental Trading Company. When that comes in, we will put them all in their <laughs> puke buckets together. Have a great day, everyone. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe.